Hi guys, this is my review on the Princess Serenity Cube Basket. Let's start with the box. It has these beautiful pictures of the figure all over it and it's very very pretty. Here is the logo of Queen King. We have the Van Presto logo, the 20th anniversary logo, and the Cube Basket logo. In the sides, we have more pictures of her, which is beautiful. This is the same thing as the front, the three logos right here. We have the top with the biggest logo. And the bottom. Now let's open it up. Every single hole in this box is covered with tape so it might be a little bit hard for you to remove it and you need to be very 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 patient if you want to remove all the tape that is all around it. It's everywhere. Okay, the figure comes in this weird thing. It's all made in cardboard. And I think you can pull it out. And here is how she looks like. She comes in this uh, plastic bag, all sealed, so she cannot. this part cannot move to this part and so on. Which is okay, let's open it up. Here are the three pieces out of the plastic bag. We have a princess serenity head. So you just need to do a little bit of assembling and that's it. It's not that bad. This is her body. She is barefoot. And this is the stand. In the back it says a Van Presto 2015 made in China. And here is the beautiful figure all assembled and looking amazing. Let me show you the details. I don't know if you can see on video, but if you look at her odangos, when, when the light reflects, you can notice that all the hair has a lot of sparkles, which is very, very nice. She got very nice pepperly white painted on the hair. Her face looks so sweet. I like her. Every single detail is very nice painted on. Her eyes are painted as well. And they're very reflective. I'm not very sure about her earrings. I don't know. They, they kind of look odd to me. But they are not that noticeable. Her dress has sparkles as well. It is all painted in like a pearly white, so it looks very, very nice. Look at all those details, they are beautifully sculpted. Whoever is doing these sculptures, they are beautiful. This figure just looks fantastic. The bow is very nice as well. I love the motion, it's just perfect. And her curls looks very, very cute. I need some light. They remind me a lot of a pulley doll, and I think you know why. Their heads are enormous, but they are very, very cute. And something that I would like to say is that, unlike Sailor Moon, you don't have to have like a stand right here just holding her head, because her skirt or her dress is just, it does all the job in balancing this figure. 
so you don't have to worry about her falling or something. Also, their head moves around, so you can put it in different positions if you don't like the original. I paid like $10 from Amazon Japan, and I am very very happy with it. She is perfect. It has a very very nice quality. It's worth the price, definitely. I think it looks better than other figures I have seen. If you have any questions, please let me know in the comments. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe so you can take a look at more of my videos. And also, please follow me on Instagram. I will be updating pictures of her very very soon so you can see more details. This is the end of my review. See you in the next one. Bye!